So I've just been thinking about some stuff that's been going over the, on over the last couple of weeks. A very uh, viral moment on Friday, um, I put up this tweet, uh, which you should see on your screen right now, to Jamie Oliver in regards to Friday Night Feast, uh, I believe it's called, with him and Jimmy at Jimmy's farm, uh, which was quite interesting as he liked the tweet and answered me back, which was really, really cool. A bit of a fanboy for Jamie, to be fair. So that was quite cool. But actually, um, when it went viral. Um, currently, that tweet has over a hundred thousand impressions, which is bloody impressive <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. Uh, so that was pretty cool. Uh, that was quite nice. Just simply because um, I love him. Right? He's cool. I've decided then. The second thing I've decided over the last few while is to take the website down. Um, I've been spending a lot of time thinking about it and. Because I, f- I focus on like five different areas and I'm one guy so it's really really hard for me to keep it up. I want to make sure that everything that I'm doing is now video based rather than written based. Although I'll still be performing uh, and producing articles for Medium on a lot of the new stuff that I do that's separate to the kind of food stuff right. So that's pretty cool. So that that's kind of get taken down. Fatladfood.com now points towards YouTube for the moment. I'm working on an interim solution this particular point in time but don't worry my recipes will soon hopefully be available my plan is basically to put every single one of my recipes into a book so there'll be 150 plus recipes in a um paperback no pictures no frills just a straight up paperback with all the recipes built into it and um, so i'm going to start working on that over the next couple of weeks that'll take a few months to get that built out but it should be pretty cool sell that through lulu.com for a measly price there paperbacks are really really cheap actually it's about six or seven pound or something but there's like 150 recipes in it so we'll get that sold out through facebook and through lulu.com um, and we'll go from there other main thing is that my video game stepped up a good bit i got a really cool app on my phone so i'm now able to turn all of my instagram stories into proper videos which is something as you know i've been working on for a very long period of time my first ever video experiences were instagram stories right and that's where the hashtag insta recipes came from that's on my youtube website and that's where i really started to play with video so it's pretty cool to see that come for full circle into 100 and, sorry 1080p and um, 60 frames per second which is pretty pretty good so i'm very very excited about that i hope you all have a great day and uh that's everything for me for now